What's up, Beyonce girl? Man, I'm back with another video, and as you can see, I'm still wearing the same exact look um, as the last video I just did. But that's because it's the same day, and I just wanted to give y'all a little bit more than just one video today, because I haven't did like a double or triple upload in a while, so. Yeah, Some choices, they run it out of options Cause I've been going off and they don't know when it's stopping it. As you can see by the title, I'm going to be doing a TMI tag um, Which is just a bunch of questions that are basically asking for too much information um, There were 100 questions, but I did send out the link to the website to a couple of my friends And I just had them pick some questions So I had 8 friends pick 2 questions a piece So now I have 16 questions that I'm just going to do and yeah let's get to it so the very first question that was picked was have i ever kissed a girl yes i mean i went to college if you go to college you're gonna end up kissing a girl at some point i mean it's just it is what it is all right so the next question was what how old was i when i had my, my first sexual experience my first sexual like actual having sex like I was 18 when I first had sex and I was at it <laughs> I gotta blur that out because I said my school name but anyway I was staying on campus for like a week and let me just start from here so basically I had a friend who lived in a dorm and I knew all her sweet mates we were all like a group of friends or whatever we were all cool one of the girls who was supposed to live in their dorm didn't come to school so they basically had an empty room and I stayed in that room so if you know I didn't want to go all the way home after dance practice which ended at like 11 o'clock at night and I had class at 8 o'clock in the morning I would just stay in that dorm <sighs> okay my bad but basically I was staying in the dorm and you know my little crush pulled up like he the side nigga from the freaking story time. I'm telling you, this nigga been in my life for like ever. But I don't want to keep calling him a side nigga. But anyway, I was, when I first had sex, I was 18. So yeah, remember I said don't have sex in high school. I didn't say shit about college. But I mean, it would be great to wait until you know married and stuff. But if you had a high school crush, you'll understand, bro. Like I wanted this boy for so long and. Like, I got my high school crush and dogged him out. I'm just kidding. I didn't dog him. We good. We cool. But yeah, um, I was 18 when I first had sex. Next. The next question, I need to find something else to say because that's getting repetitive. But anyway, the next question is, how old was I when I had my first kiss? I was 16 years old when I had my first kiss. And it was in my boyfriend's backyard. So... Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah, mm. I was so scared, like, I was so scared and shy, I didn't want to kiss him, but he was fine, so, I mean, hey, like, it had to happen at some point, like, so, yeah, my first kiss was when I was 16. Okay, so, how many boyfriends have I had? I only had two, like, real boyfriends, like, I don't count my high school boyfriend as actual, like, boyfriend. Because he wasn't shit because he broke up with me because I wouldn't have sex with him. But it's like, I'm not having sex in high school, bitch. So, bye. Shit, he ended up getting an STD. And, you know, I grew up look, to look good. So, <laughs> it's a win. <laughs> but, yeah, I only had, like, two real boyfriends. The one I got now and the one I had, like, two years ago. That's it. <laughs> Alright, so, up next, I got the questions, like, down here. So, if y'all ever see me looking, like, down, that's because the questions are right there. But... The question is, do I smoke? No, I do not smoke cigarettes. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Have I ever had a crush on a teacher? Yes. How old? I was in the sixth grade. And I just thought he was cute. Like, he was the reading teacher, but all the girls in our class thought he was so fine. Like, I don't even, some of my old teachers watch my YouTube videos. And I don't know if he do, but I don't want to take the chance. But, I mean, hey, you, I'm grown now, so. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I'm grown now, but I got a whole boyfriend who I care about a lot. And I will not leave my man for a teacher that I had a crush on in sixth grade. But, Mr. Wall, if you are watching, I am 21. <laughs> okay, let's go to the next question. Go. All right, so have I ever been with a girl? Yes, I have been with a girl before. It was for like, like four or five months, but then I realized I don't like bitches, so 
she just had to go no i'm just kidding we are still friends we are cool you know we don't even break it up we don't talk about it like you know it's just like oh hi how are you oh bye see you later like it's like that so it wasn't that serious and again i was in college so i mean it don't hold weight you know it's college <laughs> Next. Right, I know the bitch that picked this question is so annoying because she don't answer. But have I ever, have I, what is it? Have I ever had a threesome before? Yes. Okay. Next question is, um, what is my biggest fear? My biggest, yeah, I skipped over that because I'm going to turn it into a story time, maybe. If y'all want me to talk about my little threesome experience, let a bitch know. Again, I was in high school, so it don't hold weight. But it happened. I was grown, though. Well, you know, I was an adult. I'm still not grown. I'm not grown until I'm 25. Because when you're 25, you know, your insurance go down. You get all these little nice whatever, you know, little discounts or whatever. Because technically you're a legal adult. Oh, and you can rent a car. But anyway, well, you can rent a car if you're under 25, but when you're under 25, you got, like, this little fee, but y'all can hear about that. But, yeah, I might turn my little threesome story into a story time. I don't want my mom to watch this video, but if she do, hey, uh, it hold no way. I was in college. Please, I don't want to talk about it with my mom. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. But it hold no way. I was in college. But anyway, my biggest fear you know, that's the next question. What is my biggest fear? My biggest fear is I'm going to see the spider. The spider going to see me. And then the spider going to shoot a web at my face. And then the spider going to come on my face. Like, oh, I'm so scared of that shit. Like, I'm so scared. Like, I can't have that happen because I would die. Uh, I'm not even being funny or over dramatic. Like, I'll be gone. I won't be here no more. At all, period. Next. Well, the question at first was... Who was my wor who was my worst sexual experience with? But I don't want to blow their spot up. I wasn't gonna say their name anyway. Um, because damn, if you know me, you know I only really messed with two people, so <laughs> and one is my boyfriend, the other one is like, you know, everybody know. Well everyone doesn't know, but if you know me personally then you would know. But basically I've only had like, you know, I don't know how, how to say it because I don't want to blow his spot up. But basically, I would just say, she changed it and said, who, what sexual experience, wait, what was your worst sexual experience and what sign was it? Um, it was just the whole thing was just bad. Like, I just, I didn't really know what sex was at the time. Like, I was just kind of getting into sex and figuring out, like, I guess, like, what I like, what I don't like. And... I don't like that. It's <laughs> just so now that I kind of got a feel of, you know, what good sex is, you know, that shit was trash. And they, I can't even say their side because everybody gonna know. Um, but yeah. Next. <laughs> My female celebrity crush is Chai the Greatest Shot. I have like. Ever since I had a tongue piercing, a snake eyes piercing, my speech is like a little, uh, but yeah. Um, her name is Ch Chai the Greatest. Chai. <sighs> Chai the Great, Chai the Greatest, that is her name. So if y'all watch her YouTube videos, make sure you tell her that she's my female celebrity crush and she should take me on a date, you know, like a friend date, you know, like, I just not like a date date, like that girl not even legal, but she'll be legal on the 13th. Okay, but I got a boyfriend. But anyway, the <laughs> next question is, who is my male celebrity crush? I don't really crush, I don't have like a celebrity male crush. Um. Dang, I can't even, oh, I think his name is Lath. he played in Get Out, um, the guy, like, when he flashed the picture, he was all acting crazy, like, get out, get out, like, him, I think he's so fine, mm. Next, okay, so next, did I ever have to sneak out the house, no, I never had a reason to sneak out the house, you know, it, I didn't have a reason to sneak out the house. It was usually like, oh, you know, I'm going here, you know, I'm going there. Like, I never had to sneak out the house. So, you know. Um, have I ever stuck a boy to the house? Before I answer this question, because I know my mom probably watching, I never stuck a boy to my mother's house. Um, I never really stuck a boy into. I, let me not even say that. I didn't stick a boy to my grandma's house. I was living with my dad, and I didn't stick a boy in. But my brother caught us. We wasn't doing nothing. We was just hanging out, chilling. 
mind your business actually don't worry about it yes i have stuck a boy to the house but next question okay so the oldest person that i ever been with um i don't know if that meant sexually or just period but they were 24 i was 19. yeah I, well they're 24 now so when i was 19 he was 22 turning 23 but i was turning 20 but you know it was like around that age but that was the oldest person he was 23 so you know i don't stray too far you know i liked him you know he had a he had a bachelor's degree you feel me like he was just freaking crazy and i got a couple story times about him because this nigga was a nut like just a whole crazy ass nut but we have one more question so let's just get to it all right have i ever had a one night stand hell no i just can't meet somebody and just have sex with them like I don't know how y'all do that. Uh, I mean, if that's what you do, you know, it's cool. You know, you only live once. But the life I'm living this one time, I'm not going to spend it fucking strangers. I'm not. But I hope you guys enjoyed this little TMI tag. I'm thinking of doing, you know, a getting to know me tag because I did one last year. But, you know, I'm not that bitch no more. I'm a whole new bitch. Like, you know, I'm confident. I feel pretty. You know, I feel like I can talk to y'all. So, we're going to do another all about me. We're going to do an all about me tag part two um, real soon. Probably not tonight because it's getting late and I'm tired. Uh, we also gonna have like you know my little lit playlist video. We gotta have a lot of little videos. Like I'm really happy. Like I don't know if it's because I feel like I look cute. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> but yeah, make sure you tell your homegirls about me. Make sure you let them know they need to watch me because. I'm going to turn out to be our best friend. I like, you know, your favorite cousin, your big sister, whatever. So make sure you subscribe. Tell your homegirls to subscribe. Tell your niggas to subscribe. I don't even care. Just make sure you, make sure you subscribe. I love y'all. That's it. Damn. Oh, no. I didn't do that. Over. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I didn't. That's it. <laughs>